Adobe Creative Cloud has a lot of apps for all sorts of workflows, from video editing to graphic design to augmented reality. And I'm going to run through what all of them do and how they work together in a creative workflow. Check the description below for time codes for the different workflows as well. Let's start with Adobe's apps for design and layout, which are Photoshop, Illustrator, InDesign, Acrobat, Spark, Capture, InCopy, and Bridge. If there's one app you already know and love, it's probably Photoshop. As well as photo manipulation, it has the tools to bring graphic design elements to the next level by integrating photos, textures, and effects to create movie posters, book covers, and anything where the imagery is the focus. You can use it on your desktop and on the go as well. Illustrator is the best place to design logos, experiment with colors, and create vector designs. Its vector-based workflow allows you to create incredibly complex or huge designs with a tiny file size and maximum editability. InDesign is the app to go to for layout and page design, for print and digital media. InDesign has all the tools you need to create and publish books, digital magazines, ebooks, posters, interactive PDFs, and more. Acrobat allows you to save and share high quality PDFs that are easy to protect and look right on any screen. You can review documents in real time with your team, sign documents electronically, create and edit PDFs as well. Spark is the quickest way to produce video and graphic assets for social media to promote your business or grow a social following. It's available on mobile and web for you to make videos, memes, newsletters, or whatever you want with your own designs, or tons of templates that you can customize to your brand. Capture lets you use your mobile device as a vector converter to turn photos into color themes, patterns, type, materials, brushes, and shapes, and then bring those assets into your desktop and mobile apps like Photoshop, Illustrator, and Dimension to use in all of your creative projects. These apps are all tools for design and layout. In a nutshell, InDesign is the main layout app for larger documents, Photoshop helps add effects and details to bring images to the next level, and Illustrator for logos and vector design. Spark is a much simpler templated online tool for those with either less design experience or those who need to make a lot of content very quickly. And there are also two more really useful apps as well. InCopy to help you edit the source text in InDesign documents and Bridge, which is the best way to keep your files organized. Adobe's video and motion apps include Premiere Pro, Premiere Rush, After Effects, Animate, Audition, Character Animator, Media Encoder, and Prelude. Premiere Pro is an incredibly robust video editing application for film, TV, and the web. You can color correct your footage, mix audio, add titles, transitions, effects, and craft your raw footage into polished films and videos. Premiere Rush allows you to create and edit new projects from any device. It's got all the essentials from Premiere Pro simplified and optimized so that you can go from shooting your footage to sharing online as fast as possible. Perfect for those wanting to get started sharing videos on YouTube, Instagram, and TikTok. After Effects is the app for motion graphics and visual effects. It's perfect if you're wanting to create animations, combine videos and images, or take your footage to the next level with amazing effects. You can apply hundreds of effects to remove unwanted footage, objects, or even people from your footage. Adobe Animate, formerly known as Flash, allows you to create HTML web banners, interactive animation for games, TV shows, or the web, and you can create frame-by-frame -frame animated cartoons animated avatars, or just bring your banner ads to life and quickly publish to multiple platforms in just about any format. Audition is the place for audio. It is a comprehensive tool set that includes multi-track waveform and spectral display for creating, mixing, editing, and restoring audio content. It's designed to accelerate video production and deliver a polished mix with pristine sound from sound mixing videos to recording podcasts, it is the go-to for the best audio. Character Animator uses your expressions and movements to animate characters in real time. It's so fast that you can live stream with an animated avatar. Using your camera and microphone, Character Animator matches your expressions from syncing lips to tracking your eyes. So from creating videos on Instagram and YouTube to high-res videos and professional podcasts, you have everything you need. There are also two really useful apps to help in the back end. Media Encoder and Prelude. They help organize and output your footage, making it easier and quicker, so you can focus on the creative stuff. Now to Adobe's photography apps. Photoshop, Lightroom, Lightroom Classic, Photoshop Express, and Photoshop Camera. Photoshop is a powerful piece of image editing software to transform photos and remove and add features. You can quickly and easily manipulate photography, but also create your own designs, illustrations, and artworks. It can also be used in UI and UX workflows, but it isn't a core feature. Lightroom comes in two flavors, Lightroom and Lightroom Classic. Both applications essentially let you bring out the best in your photos, punch up the colors, make dull looking shots vibrant, remove distracting objects, and straighten some skewed shots. It's also a great way to easily organize all of your photos and share them. 
Lightroom is cross-device and available on mobile and iPad too, with images saved to the cloud. Lightroom Classic is optimized for desktop for more of a traditional photography approach, tethering your camera to the computer. Photoshop Express is essentially Photoshop for your mobile. You can edit your images in a few clicks, remove blemishes, apply effects, and enhance your photos to post straight to social media, or even send them to Photoshop if you want to take them to the next level with more advanced tools. Photoshop Camera is an intelligent camera app that auto-suggests a wide range of lenses and filters to make your images stand out. The lenses and camera effects can be applied before or after the shot, and it's really easy to swap them in and out, so you don't have to worry about changing your mind later. All of these apps can improve your photography. Lightroom is for when you want to tweak and enhance what's already in them, and Photoshop is for when you want to take your work and create something more by really manipulating it or integrating other elements. Now let's take a look at Adobe's illustration apps, Illustrator, Fresco, and Photoshop. Illustrator is the top vector graphic software used by designers and artists to create everything from web and mobile graphics to logos, icons, book illustrations, product packaging, and billboards. Because it uses vectors, art that is stored as paths rather than as pixels, it can be scaled up infinitely without any loss of resolution. Illustrator is also soon coming to the iPad as well. Fresco is built for the latest stylus and touch devices, and it brings together the world's largest collection of vector and raster brushes, plus new live brushes that give realistic oil and watercolor effects to deliver the most natural painting and drawing experience. This is the app to use if you want the closest digital experience to illustrating with traditional media. Photoshop, again, not just for photo manipulation and image compositing, also has a huge library of brushes and tools to create stunning illustrations, digital paintings, concept art, and even animation. Now for Adobe's UI and UX apps, XD and Dreamweaver. With Adobe XD, you get one powerful tool for your whole UI UX design process. You can create user flows, wireframes, high fidelity designs, interactive prototypes, animations, and more with no need to switch between multiple apps or worry about keeping designs in sync. In Dreamweaver, you can quickly create and publish web pages almost anywhere. Create, code, and manage dynamic websites easily with a smart, simplified coding engine. You can access code hints and quickly learn and edit HTML, CSS, and other web standards. Now onto 3D and AR with Dimension and Aero. With Dimension, you can create engaging 3D content faster with high quality models, materials, and lighting. You can visualize your branding, packaging, and logo designs in 3D drag and drop vector graphics or images onto a 3D model to see it in real context. Aero allows you to design and share augmented reality experience using assets you've created in Dimension, Photoshop, Illustrator, and more. Really quickly and really simply, Aero automatically optimizes your assets for AR so you can see them in real time. Pitch concepts and prototypes to clients by putting your work right in front of them. Lastly, but not leastly, Adobe's web apps and services. Behance, Portfolio, Stock, and Spark. Behance is an online platform to showcase, get inspiration, and discover creative work. You can upload your own projects, engage with other creatives, and broadcast your process widely and efficiently. Portfolio allows you to quickly and simply build a professional website to showcase your creative work that looks professional. With Adobe Stock, you can find high-res, royalty-free stock imagery to add to your creative projects. Photos, vectors, illustrations, videos, audio, 3D assets, design, and video templates. You can even access high res and preview images right within Creative Cloud applications. And Spark that I mentioned before lets you quickly produce custom branded graphics and videos for your social media channels, newsletters, and websites. With Adobe Creative Cloud, you get access to all of these apps that are designed to work together. So no matter the size of your team, whatever you're creating, and wherever you are in your workflow, you don't need to focus on the tools. You can focus on what's most important to the project.